He was elected four months ago amid calls for reform in the Catholic Church. Today, Pope Francis stamped his biggest mark yet on the papacy. In a wide-ranging and open discussion with reporters, he was asked about gays in the church. His response included five words that are now being scrutinized around the world. Who am I to judge? Catherine Cullen has more on the Pope's comments and the reaction to them. Catherine. Peter, the Pope hardly draped himself in a rainbow flag. He still upholds the Catholic teaching that homosexual acts are a sin. But he also says it's not for him to pass judgment. <laughs> the first clue something is different, a Pope who cracks jokes. Then there's his remarkable willingness to take reporters' questions. For 80 minutes, he answered every single one. Pope Francis showed not just an openness to talking, many are also remarking on his openness when asked about gay priests. His predecessor, Pope Benedict, famously signed a document in 2005 saying men with deep-seated homosexual tendencies should not be priests. Pope Francis told reporters it was important not to discriminate or marginalize gay people. Welcome words in the gay and lesbian communities. Wow, you know, finally a pope that kind of acknowledged that there are gay people around the world, LGBT people, and, and kind of show some openness. But many in the church say this isn't a shift in doctrine, that Pope Francis is consistent with his predecessors. The church has always made a distinction between acts and the person itself, you know, and, and the person is a son of God or a daughter of God, you know, and is loved by Christ, and none of them, you know, is to be rejected. But I think uh, perhaps the difference with Francis is just the question of tone. He points to Pope Francis's trip to Brazil as evidence that the Pope believes in bringing people together. He doesn't just want to focus on one group, you know, and the, the question of the homosexuals and that answer is one of the groups, but it's not the only one. Those who are pushing for changes on the church's stance on homosexuality hope this is a sign of more to come. There's a huge gap between what the official church teaches and, and what the people in the pews support. But there are limits to the openness Pope Francis has shown. He told reporters that women should have a larger role in the church, but not, he said, as priests. Peter? Catherine Cullen in Montreal tonight. Thank you, Catherine.